hello everyone welcome back to how we rose cook you already know what we're making based on the title and you can see the creaminess the deliciousness so keep on watching here i have five egg yolks in this bowl i'm gonna go ahead and add quarter cup of sugar and we're gonna whisk them until we get a nice rich creaminess once we have achieved that consistency we're gonna go ahead and start our milk ingredients so this is exactly what we're looking for we're now gonna head over to the stove so i've added half cup of milk and half cup of heavy cream now i'm grating my nutmeg and then we're gonna go ahead and add some cinnamon powder and vanilla and I will list all the ingredients and the measurement in the description box so you can check it out. If you're watching from Facebook, then I'll list it in the comment section. Alright, so now that my liquid is getting hot, I have ice cream stabilizer. It's supposed to give your ice cream that store-bought feel. It's supposed to be nice and smooth, but it's very tricky. You have to know how to use it. Because I've not yet figured it out, I'm going to use just a pinch because you can't use too much. If you put too much in there, spoil the ice cream. If you don't have it, leave it out. It's completely fine. I've made ice cream several times without it. And just a pinch in there. I'm going to turn my liquid off. And then we're going to head over to the eggs. Alright, this method is called tempering the eggs the eggs can get scrambled really quickly with the hot liquid so in order for it not to scramble you add it in gradually so while I'm whisking I'm adding in my hot liquid drizzle by drizzle Add in a little more and then we're gonna combine everything what I'm gonna do now is gradually mix in the eggs into the hot milk Alright, so now we have the stove on low to medium heat. We're going to allow it to cook to a temperature where it's safe to eat. And this will take about 5 minutes. Don't allow it to boil because the egg will start to scramble. And don't cook it too long. And this smells so good right now. As you can see, no scrambling of the eggs after five minutes it should be good and I mix out a little bit of egg powder this is optional I mix out a little bit of egg powder just to add a little color if you don't have egg powder that's fine make it without this is just for color egg powder is tasteless it just adds color but it's totally tasteless I just mix out like a pinch, just a pinch with some of the milk to add a little color to my ice cream. When I use more egg, I get that rich yellow color, but I don't want too much egg. I use only five, but when I'm making eggnog, I use like 10 eggs, 10 egg yolks. All right, this is ready now. You can see, you don't see any scrambling of any eggs. It's nice and smooth, but to be sure, you want to run it through a strainer. You can smell the cinnamon, the nutmeg, the vanilla, everything combined. It smells so good. Once it smells raw, that means it's no longer a custard. Your egg starts to scramble. All right. All 
right so now I'm going to place this in the refrigerator until I'm ready to use it I'm gonna add my heavy whipping cream and I'm gonna whip it until it has a like a soft peak This is the consistency that you're going for. I'm gonna mix in my sweetener, which is condensed milk. Eggnog mixture. Eggnog wouldn't be eggnog without rum, so I add a little bit of rum, not too much. Or if you want to go hard, you can add a little more. So I'm going to put this in the freezer, and tomorrow we will come back and see the result. It tastes really good, really, really good. So let's hope it freezes properly. Thursday is my birthday, so we'll have some eggnog ice cream. I'm gonna be making a series of ice cream. My mother wants me to make the um, mango ice cream. So we're gonna do that as well. So that it's nice and creamy. And it tastes good. Put this over it. into the freezer and we'll see you back tomorrow hi everyone welcome back we're gonna be checking on our ice cream now i took it out about five minutes ago just so it's not that hard to scoop so let me show you here it is let's scoop This is so creamy and nice, guys. We just take a quick picture before we dive in. It is creamy. And there's no ice crystal, thank God. Thank y'all so much for watching. And I have a series of ice cream coming. The next one will be coconut ice cream. And trust me, you don't want to miss that one. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. And I'll catch you in my next one.